We're often careful to talk about Joseph as the earthly father of Jesus because we see God as Jesus' father. But from Joseph's perspective, isn't it true that whoever is the father, biological or otherwise, of this child that Mary's about to give birth to, one thing Joseph knows is that he is not the father. But he becomes the father of Jesus, doesn't he? By choice. He intentionally agrees to raise this child as his own, to show fatherly love towards this child. Is that an experience you've had in your life? I know that as an adoptive parent, I have loved my adopted children as if they're my own because they are my own. And same has held true for those foster children in my life. Perhaps you've had that experience of being adopted or fostered, or there are those people that gather around your Christmas table who are like family to you because that's what family is. Isn't it interesting that Jesus had this experience in this world and then tells us that God is like a father to us? It may not be a good example for many people because they don't have great relationships with their own earthly father. But Jesus clearly did and knew what it was like to be loved and cared for when it wasn't necessary, wasn't required that came out of a deep abiding love. That is who God is for you and for me. Regardless of whatever experiences are in this world, we have the experience of one who loves us, not because we must be loved, but because God wants to love us.